Hello everyone and welcome to my video diary where I will explain how TV, video productions and gaming is used to identify pace, mood and tone. So please sit down and enjoy. So to start off this is a trailer from Halo Reach. Uh, she's running for a battleground and the music playing at the start is actually going with the heartbeat to make it sound more dramatic, it makes it more intense and it makes it involve with the audience. The pace of this soundtrack is actually quite slow. There may be a war going on, but the music is quite calm and you could say focused. What I mean by that is the character's emotions seem to be bottled out, and she knows what she needs to do to complete the mission. The tone of this soundtrack is actually quite calm, but strong. As I said earlier, it's still a war zone, but the trek is actually quite peaceful. The mood, on the other hand, feels heroic, but when the vocals start to kick in, it starts to give you a realisation of what has just happened, and that she's not going to make it out alive. The gunshots and explosions help to set the mood and pace, and the jetpack sound actually makes me feel sad easy because you know he's not going to come back for her. At the end there is a big explosion and the vocals are slowly dying down. I feel this sets it off quite nicely and that you know he has completed the mission. This is my second piece that I'm going to talk about, this is the Dead Island trailer. It's a lot more emotional than the last one and it's a lot slower paced, but I feel it has more impact. Now the mood of this one straight away, it's sad and it's a horror. You can tell that it's sad because it starts off with a girl laying on the floor and the music in general is slow and it kind of goes to the heartbeat just like the first one. Now the footsteps of the little girl and the zombie noises both point to her being vulnerable. This makes it more engaging for the viewer because we don't want anything bad happening to her, even though we already know that she turns into a zombie. <laughs> This piece is actually quite mellow. I feel they did a good decision on this because it makes the slow motion side of this calm. Whereas the normal speed part is full of sound effects and loud noises, it creates fear in both the animated people's lives and both our lives. Now the pace, as you probably have already guessed, is very slow. A reason being is that it's very dramatic and half of the uh, production is in slow motion anyway. 